I got Metallica off in time. We'll find out at some point. We're going live. Looking live. With a bunch of die cast from a thrift store that no longer exists and quite frankly hasn't existed in uh, hmm, since February. I didn't find it out until it was on my way to Toys R Us for the last time. So I thought I would swing in there and I hadn't been in there in a month. Well, I missed the, they're uh, going out of business shale, if you want to call it that. Pretty cool one right here. Let's save that one. There's some red liners in there. What's up, Mazda Cosmo? Let me see a red liner and some old Matchbox super fast in that one. Some of the stuff, mo I know I got this one probably back in December, January. I think January after I sold some stuff on offer. I think I got this one. But the majority of these right here I've had for probably at least a year still in the package from the thrift store that no longer exists. And it's too bad because it was kind of a cool one where I was almost, I mean, here we go, $1.99 yet. And there's always coupons, so I never got it for the asking price. But there's, we get five, five or six cars in here, so not bad. About 30 cents a car, so sometimes better, sometimes not as good. The Dagobah system. So let's get to it. Not all these are from there. These loose ones aren't. But let's start it off. Let's uh, not waste any more time. Here's a dollar ninety nine, which I I always got these for at least twenty five percent off. So I probably paid a buck fifty for this bag here. Mazda Cosmo, in case you guys don't know, is up to date on uh, diecast. New and old. It's like a walking Wikipedia. My foot itches. I hope it's not an athlete's foot. It's late in a long time, so I don't see how it could be. But stranger things have happened. Here, let me do a little scratching. Scratchy scratch. Uh, you can see a yo yo in this uh, lot here. Try not to get stabbed by. If you saw a ghost jerker recently, got stabbed by uh, his flea market haul staples from the, the Ziploc bags. He was busting open and man, what it! I want a flea market like that. He always seems to beat you. If it's not Hot Wheels Dave, it's some other vendor there. Always. It seems. Great score. Great scores on that channel. For a great channel though, so hey, only fitting, right? Alright, let's see. Is this a toothbrush? No. Yeah, not very fun. What a, oh, hello? 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 Can you hear me? Hello? Is it salt and pepper shakers? See, this would be salt and this would be pepper, right? Salt and pepper shakers. Do it same time. If you want one on your eggs. Right? And that's what this is. Oh, yeah. I like my eggs with lots of salt and pepper. There we go. Mashed potatoes and gravy. Hmm. Okay. Well, obviously, there's not a whole lot use for this. Can you hear me now? It's almost time to trim nails. All right. I'm just going to dig. Ah, see, I got stabbed by the staple. Stabbed by the staple. What? Stabbed by the staple. Oh, yes. I've wanted a pair of pliers like this for eons. Yep. Your tool set is not complete. Until you have a pair of pliers like this. Let me tell you something. So we got a salt and pepper shaker right here. Salt, pepper, like that. On you. If you want to do it at the same time on your mashed potatoes. Maybe on your Brussels sprouts or uh, hamburgers or whatever. Whatever's clever. Oh, there we go. Hey, what's up, Skullman2012? All right, what we got here? This is, uh, what does that say? It says, almost golf. Hold on, let me bounce it on the concrete here. Oops, sorry. 
Just lost it. Nope, I got it now. All's good again. Almost golf, so I don't know. This is supposed to be uh I don't know. Take it out on the range. Home home on the range. Pepper for shaker so far. World's best pliers. And almost golf in this dollar ninety nine bag, which I'm sure I got for a dollar fifty at the most. Yep, Peter Pan. Rip it. I'm not gonna get much use out of that. Oh yeah. Too bad I didn't have this when I sold my dragons. This is Pokemon 2016. What is this? A blind bag goofy thing or something? Dragon Breath? <sighs> I don't know. Definitely not up to date on Pokemon. Oh yeah. There we go. This is what all us old guys need right here. The inevitable. Let's see if it works. Yeah, hardly. Not hardly. Oh well. Bag has been a bust so far, but wait. The inevitable yo-yo. Spartan Shops. This is from San Jose State University. San Jose State University, better known as the college that Jeff Garcia went to before beginning his NFL career. San Jose State Spartans. Um, I don't know if they have it anymore, and I've raced in it before when I was in college. The Bruce Jenner Classic track meet there. I, um, if they hadn't done away with it already, I'm sure they have. Sorry. Oh, goody. We go from, we trans, uh, wait, no. <laughs> Let's just say we go from talking about Bruce Jenner to talking about snakes. Hey, I was only $1.99 originally, then he probably got me for a buck fifty. I'm sure you guys just came here to see the die cast, right? Well, there's that guy. And probably save this for the Nerf guns. Ooh, this one's kind of hard. I'll use it. I'll keep it in my ammo. Elephant on the wall, guys. Give this out at your next uh, white elephant party. All right, well, I guess it's a two-for-one deal. Is that a beard? What is that? What is this supposed to be? It's like a, it's like a beard. What is this? I'm almost inclined to throw this thing away right here, right now. All right, we got elephant itis there. Next up, what do we got? Hey, this is one of those Playmates, I think. Uh, Marvel, 2006 copyright. Hasbro. Yeah, very creepy. Oh, look at this. It's almost like Hulk Hogan's hair. How, you know, you just pull it back and then it would be okay, I guess. All right, so is this like Iron Man, some version of Iron Man? That I'm not aware with. It's like, talk to the hand. Talk to the blue dot matrix on the hand. Bzz. Got one there, too. Bzz. And one there. Bzz. Oh, he turns, too. All right. He swivels. I'm going to assume that's some Iron Man junk. Next up. Hey, it's uh, one of the... This isn't a Lego person. It's uh, 2000... Wait, 95? Galoob? Wait, what? Take my glasses off. I actually see better without them. Geo Bra, 1995. Hmm. Facial features leave a lot to be desired. I'm not going to lie. I'm not going to beat around the bush. This, uh, this handy manny, if he was a firefighter. Not much in the collectability department in terms of that. That I'm aware of. 
Sir, over here, sir. Here, you take care of it. Two thousand five copyright. I don't know what it's from. To be honest with you, I don't know. All right, cool. Well, we got another one. Look at the pants. Pants in that sweater just they're horrible. This is another of the play school or whatever. Nineteen eighty two copyright. Love the sweater. That's just wonderful. So as you can tell, what is this? Popo 2009. It's uh, Cleopatra and her pet rat. Montefusco. What? what was that? I don't know what that was. Yeah, in terms of collectability, nah, I'd rather just break it and throw it away. I don't know. Okay, we got a little puppy dog here. The inevitable. Oh, we're tired. Puppy dog. 2000, wait. 2005 copyright. All right. We got another wrench. This one, not operational. Camel Joe. Next up, get all before the die cast. Nope, we got <sighs> crap. Rubber ducky. Things hard as a rock. What is this? An eraser? All right, have we gotten through all the shenanigans yet? Can you use this uh, practice here. Golf game. Lieutenant Dan, ice cream. Ice cream, Lieutenant Dan. Alright, that's all the shenanigans there. Benzene. China gas. Pull back. Oh, crap. That thing hauls. That's a good one. My eye itches. All right. Let's get to getting here. Matchbox made in Chin. It's Mac. Fire rescue unit. Floodlight heavy rescue. Next up. Look at this. Hey, for you guys that are in here, how's the live stream tonight compared to, well, just how is it tonight? I like how they got a Hot Wheels sticker on here, even though this is a matchbox. We got a good live stream tonight. All right, good. Went back and watched the race one. Man, epic racing all for nothing. There we go. Matchbox Super Fast Tire Fryer, number 42, made in Jolly Old England, 1972. That one's pretty fast, I guess. Not shabby at all. Oh, excuse me. Probably make a good King of the Misfits car. Speaking of which, if you missed out on King of the Misfits and that live racing, 
we saw the title change hands twice in one night. That's right. We had the same King of the Misfits champion for two years. The Dodge Viper RT10. And he lost to the number one contender, the Ford GT90. And the Ford GT90 then lost. <laughs> then lost to the uh, Rapid Transit or whatever it's called. Rescue Transit, Rescue Ranger. I'm about to plug my phone in. All right, last but not least, Thrasher. What's up, Commander Toucan? Yep, we'll be doing King of the Misfits Monster Trucks. I know I've been talking about it for a long time, but we will be doing King of the Misfit Monster Trucks. Yeah, let's do this. While well, you guys are admiring the Thrasher there. Here comes the X. Here comes the Thrasher. The demolition. I have to get the phone ready for the inevitable charge. Move this pencil. Ow. Always getting jacked up when I do live videos. Without fail. Alright guys, so uh, you can comment here in the live stream or comment down below. Okay, we are charging it now. Cool. What you thought of the uh, best thing in this lot. This was uh, $1.99, but I'm pretty sure I got it for uh dollar fifty. So we got the you know the salt and pepper shaker. You put the salt here, pepper here, and shake it all over your food. Some creepy stuff. Some uh, yeah, stuff I will never use. It'd be going in some sort of big old lot. Yeah, always do, man. So just to recap, buck fifty got me creepy, creepy guy here or girl, or whatever it is. I want the generous looking thing. Rubber ducky got me uh, Camel Joe. Who's ready to get back on the uh, YouTube Cup series? Who's ready to see some more YouTube Cup racing? YouTube Cup? Yes. Cobra Commander. Hey, look at this snake actually has a, from 2009. This snake was probably uh, recalled in 2009. Yeah, a lot of just worthless stuff in here. And, and uh, yeah, as far as I'm concerned, <laughs> this is kind of cool. As long as I didn't get my hands caught on a staple, which I didn't. Let's go ahead and discard this stuff. We're going to go on to the next. The cup. YouTube cup. Boy, 50. What do we got? Over 50 cars now. Uh, if you guys saw the standings, we're one race away from the all-star race, so... We take the top 10 cars and points, and because 10th place, I think 10th place is tied, but there's a couple cars that are tied. Maybe not, I don't remember. But um, there's a race for that. And then as of the rest of the season, the top 20 are in points are guaranteed to race in the YouTube Cup. That leaves 10 qualifying spots for like, what, 30 cars, 30 over 30 cars? What do you think, guys, so far? 
dollar ninety nine. I know it was at least twenty five percent off a buck fifty. I got all those um uninteresting things I just showed you. Plus, we got this super fast uh, what do you call it tire fryer. Very cool. Don't think it'll fit on the six lane, but give it a shot. Got this fire rescue unit. Got this extremely fast pullback and a thrasher monster jam all for a buck fitty. Yeah, that's right. Hey, look, I see that same. Oh, no, I just put that. What a fool. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah, I got this inevitable dart, dude. YouTube Cup is how I found your channel. Sweet. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm going to be honest with you. The NASCAR is really what uh, brings the views to this channel. It's not what I'm doing right now. It's not the oddball stuff I will do sometimes. It's it's the NASCAR racing. It has basically saved the channel. I've said it before. I'll say it again. That being said, here's another one. $1.99. So probably got it for a buck fifty. And then of course NOS Racing, one of the that continuing the week after the YouTube Cup. Once the YouTube Cup and NOS Racing series have come to a conclusion, we will start on the truck series. Should be interesting. What is going on here? There we go. All right, let's start things off here. Maybe. All right, this is Amazon, I believe. I don't know, Flight 03. What a fool. I do that every time. That could be a good one. All right, let's see here. I uh, know that's right. 2013 Viper. Now these, uh, this is a good one too. These are all at a thrift store. This one was marked down a dollar forty nine, and I got it for probably twenty five percent off of that too. I never walked, I never bought anything that wasn't at least twenty five percent off. Thrift store, really popular one. Don't know for what rhyme or reason it went out of business <laughs> in uh, February of this year. I didn't know it went out of business. I had went there because I hadn't been there in a probably a month. I went in January and I went uh, was the last time I went there. And I went there in February to check it out as I was going to Toys R Us to check it out for the last time. And come to find out that thrift store closed down. Didn't even know it. So I find... I've... Uh, this is cool. Matchbox Mercury Cougar 68. Uh, yep. Nice. Haven't raced. Whoops. Salvage. Look at that. Tail lights. Haven't raced the Matchbox version. Seems to be pretty smooth. <laughs> I don't even remember what I was going to say. Uh, what we got here? Cadillac Cien. Nice. Very cool. This is one of those cars, though, don't appreciate until you see it in person. Yeah, sometimes it is extremely hit and miss, but like I said, this thrift store was a very good go-to one. Finding thrift cars at thrift stores at that one goodwill is i'm gonna say impossible to find just haven't had much luck there especially recently this is a utility truck huh interesting nice you play jousting like on mr mom's racing how would it fare? Let's see. Ooh.
All right. Yeah, they're very hit and miss. Sometimes just about being in the right place at the right time. What we got here? Officially. Um, well, it helps if I have it. Utility, just a utility truck. Probably be a pretty deep. So that's it from that bag. Here's one. 49 cents. Not too shabby. Oh, man. Come on. Yep. It's late. It's hot in the garage. Come on, dude. There we go. It's kind of Hulk Hogan it, I guess. When it comes crashing down and it hurts inside. Dun, 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 dun. Here we go. 49 cents. And this is a 1955 Chevy Stepside pickup. Ken Smart 132 scale. Oops. Oh, yeah. Nice. Easy way to get a shave for yourself. Very cool. It opens. Nope. Yeah, it didn't open either. That's okay. What was that? Boy, we to get through all this tonight. Oh no! Ha ha ha! Yes, this Chevy truck is cool. All right, next up on the agenda, dollar ninety nine. Again, twenty five percent off. This one. <laughs> Definitely not as heavy as ones in the past. Custom or this is super tsunami. What? Very cool. Let's kick it down another notch. Let's see. This one's a waste. Doesn't even fit on the track. Doesn't even matter. Here's horseplay. Play. We're going ballistic, bro. I will hold on to this one, I'm sure. Hopefully it's fast because I think it'll work for what I want to do. Oh, man.
ballistic. What do you guys think? One more? Who's ready to watch the Ferrari buy-in race? Let's open this one since it's already popped. Dollar ninety nine, so buck fifty. School bus. This is very cool. <sighs> the Jeep Scrambler. He is a roll well. I know. Do what now? All right. Whoa. Here we go. H3 Hummer. Oh, this is a matchbox. Very cool. Oh, man. Boy, it's hot in this garage. All right, what do you think? think? Open up one more. I got ahead of myself here. What do you guys like better, YouTube Cup or NOS Racing? You guys think one more? All right, Commander Toucan says YouTube Cup. How come you like, uh, excuse me, YouTube Cup better? So does Skull Man. Why do you guys like YouTube Cup? So how come you guys like YouTube Cup over NOS Racing? That's good feedback. So what do you think? One more? We're saving for another day. One more. Let's do this one. Dollar ninety nine which means it costs me buck fifty. Yeah, we got a NASCAR in here. Says what? Pile driver? Yep.
All right. Pile driver. The inevitable pile driver. Oh, crap. Sixty what? Sixty six Ford. Nah, man, won't even roll. Oh, we got a frog in here. <laughs> Very cool. Here's Ken Schrader, 36 M&M's car. Let's see if this car gets on for YouTube Cup. All right, oh, there's one more in the bag. This is the version, the white one, white version. Beat our champion in a title matchup. I do believe it's a Rapid Transit or Rescue Ranger or something like that. A lot more good stuff to get to. As you can see. Ooh, what's that? All right, guys. That's going to about do it for now. I'm literally falling asleep. Lay here and sitting down and me don't mix. But some cool stuff nonetheless. Make sure you're tuning into the sub before RA channel. You haven't subscribed and clicked the notification bell. Do that now. So you never miss an episode. All right, guys, going to wrap it up. A lot of cool stuff. Thanks for hanging out and going through this with me. No problem, Rhino. Been fun as usual. Look for the YouTube Cup. Um, and uh, we got... All these cars, we've got plenty to go through. Make sure you're following me on Instagram, Legion underscore of underscore diecast. I'm doing a lot of racing, qualifying races for King of the Misfits on there. So there's a lot of racing being uploaded. Thanks, JD NASCAR31. Appreciate it, man. If I had more time, it would be a million times better, but time is limited. Obviously, if I'm doing live videos at 11.34 p.m., PM Pacific time. But I appreciate you guys tuning in. I know it's late no matter where you are. YouTube Cup coming back next week. 
Nos a week after that, more than likely. And as always, guys, I thank you for watching. And we'll see you at the next one. Lots more to go through. Don't forget. Peace.